Welcome to Manifested Publishers. Hello learners, my name is Stephen Kariungi. Today we continue with our topic of discussion on chlorine and its compounds. So today we are at the level of discussing hydrogen chloride, which is one of the compounds of chlorine. So first of all, we can say that uh, hydrogen chloride is a compound of hydrogen and chlorine. And this compound exists as a molecular gas, exists as a molecular gas. And we are going to investigate uh, how this gas is prepared and what are some of the properties. So preparation of hydrogen chloride. Hydrogen chloride or HCl gas. Preparation of HCl gas. Now, hydrogen chloride is prepared in the laboratory uh, by the action of concentrated sulfuric acid on any chloride, on any chloride that doesn't form an insoluble salt. For example, we can use sodium chloride, also known as rock salt. So we can say that uh, is prepared by the action of concentrated sulfuric acid on rock salt. And rock salt, we know that this is sodium uh, chloride. So on this, the reaction that takes place, uh, we have H2SO4, which is a liquid. It combines with sodium chloride. And uh, what happens is that sodium is um, monoatomic. So it only displaces one of the hydrogen atoms. So we have sodium hydrogen sulfate plus HCl gas. So that is basically the equation. So sodium displaces one of the hydrogens from the sulfuric acid. Sulfuric acid is a dibasic acid. So when one of the hydrogens is displaced, it combines with chlorine to form hydrogen chloride. So we're going to have a, an illustration of that in form of a diagram. So to label the diagram, we have conch sulfuric acid, and then we have uh, a rock salt, which is basically sodium chloride. And then uh, once the reaction has taken place and the gas is produced here, the gas is passed through the second chamber that also has conch sulfuric acid. So we have conch sulfuric acid and this is to dry the gas. So it acts as a drying agent and then in the gas jar we collect dry hydrogen chloride gas. So we have the gas jar here. So the, our diagram illustrates the laboratory preparation of 
hydrogen chloride. And the gas is collected uh, by downward uh, delivery or upward displacement of air because the gas will settle at the bottom first. So the gas is denser than air. So it settles from the bottom up. So it displaces the air upwards. And then the mode of uh, collection is downward delivery. So we can say that uh, the gas is passed through conch sulfuric acid, which is the drying agent, which is the drying agent. The work of a drying agent is to remove the moisture, any moisture from the gas. And then, then the gas is collected by downward delivery. So the delivery tube going downwards, as you can see from the diagram, also known as upward displacement of air. Upward displacement of air. So basically that is uh, how hydrogen chloride gas uh, is prepared. So we are going to next look at the physical properties physical properties what are some of the observable uh, properties of hydrogen chloride so one is a colorless gas and that gas has a pungent choking smell the gas is volatile meaning that uh, it easily vaporizes is highly volatile when you open a can that uh, has the hydrogen chloride gas it escapes uh, it is denser than air that's why we are collecting it by downward delivery hence collected by downward delivery The gas is highly soluble in water. The effect on the litmus uh, turns a moist blue litmus paper to red. So indicating that the gas is acidic. So those are the physical properties of the gas. So we are going to have a, an assignment on this. So the first question in the assignment, write a balanced chemical equation for the preparation of hydrogen chloride gas, HCl gas. Two, why is the gas A passed through conch sulfuric acid? And B, why is it collected by downward delivery? So we'll stop there until next time. Goodbye.